emergency departments across the state have experienced a surge in arrivals. We're seeing about 200% of the normal amount of patients that we would see in the emergency department. Dr. Trisha Annis, a local emergency room doctor, says emergency rooms across Hampton Roads are seeing unprecedented numbers. 2021 and 2020 both have delivered surge after surge. This is certainly the highest volume surge we have seen so far in the pandemic. The Virginia College of Emergency Room Physicians is now asking Governor Northam to help them with resources like accessing state disaster funding and federal dollars. The reason it would re releasing more funding would be useful is because in order to address double the amount of patients coming through the doors. We need more nurses, we need more testing supplies, we need more PPE, we need more techs, we need more physician hours, and all of that does cost money. Emergency rooms are also seeing a high volume of people for COVID-19 testing. Declaring a state of an emergency will allow us to access some of those federal funds so that we can mobilize all of these additional resources that our community needs right now during this surge. Governor Northam released this statement this week saying this is not a time to panic. Further saying it's time to study not only the case numbers, but the severity of symptoms and the number of people going to the hospital. Governor Northam also urging people not to overwhelm hospitals in this statement, saying hospitals are exhausted. If you're going to the emergency room to get a COVID test, don't. That's because emergency rooms across Hampton Roads are overwhelmed. They recommend going to a testing site or getting an at-home test kit. In Hampton Roads, Leandra Head, News 3.